Queensland LNP Senator Jared Rennick has strong opinions on this about the importance of having banks available. Senator Rennick, good afternoon. What what lessons do we need to learn from this, Senator Rennick? Well, I think the lesson that we've learned today is that this will be what the future will look like uh, for many more people who rely on cash. Uh, and I think the lesson that we've learned from uh, today is, is that we need to actually have some form of uh, physical backup uh, for when electronic services collapse. When a telco go down, goes down for hours like this, what happens to businesses reliant on access to telecommunication services? Well, well, I mean, basically, they seize up. I mean, they can't, you know, unless they have, you know, use a reasonable amount of cash or have their own cash in their own safe. I mean, effectively, transactions can't occur. I've heard stories of people turning up to places today with cards, unable to pay, told to go to the nearest ATM or bank. But, of course, that's in the city or it might be quite some distance away these days. Tell me about the impact of something like this happening in regional areas. Well, what's happened today in the metropolitan areas is what happens in regional areas right now every day, and this is the reason why we're having this inquiry into the closure of branches in the regions. And it's just an example of even in metropolitan areas where people, you know, where once they might have been able to just go around the block uh, to their local uh, bank branch have now had to hop in a car and drive, say, five kilometres to ten kilometres down the road to access cash. And as we've just found out, that major banks rely on Optus as well. So... Hopefully the branch has had sufficient cash reserves. I'd be curious to know just how they coped with um, demand on cash services. But, yeah, I mean, we need the branches, you know, many branches so that people can, you know, be given the bank services that they need to uh, transact in cash or, or just perform essential, you know, have cash to uh, c- uh, conduct uh, essential services. It just shows that surely but we're becoming less resilient, our, our sort of, our health structures, our, everything from telecommunications to banking is actually losing resilience, not building it, Senator Rennick, in my mind. Yeah, no, I, I agree with you, Steve. Uh, and this is, you know, uh, this is the, the world that we live in, the technology world. I mean, it's also you could apply it to the skills sector as well in many ways where we just don't have that broad range of skills uh, amongst the tradespeople as well because we do so, we've automated so many services uh, and, of course, you know, this is a discussion for another day, but, you know, this is the same thing we're going to have to face with artificial intelligence. So you're right, when we rely so heavily on uh, telecommunications and electronic services, when that all collapses, we don't have sufficient backup in place to uh, make up for that loss. So people couldn't do electronic transactions today. Um, the banks, three of the four major banks all use Optus. Where is your... Where is the Senate inquiry into uh, regional banking branch closures at the moment? Where is that at at the moment? Uh, we've got another hearing on the 1st of December here in Canberra, and then we're looking at locations early next year in South Australia, Northern Territory, Western Australia, and we hope to wrap it up by April next year. All right. And, and, and will is this Optus outage relevant to that sort of banking inquiry? Absolutely. I think it shows that this is what people in regional areas are already encountering. And I think it's a, uh, a mirror into the future uh, where uh, e- even in uh, outer metropolitan areas where people can't access, you know, if they can't, for example, do an electronic transaction, they've got to travel long distances just to get access to cash. I'll leave it there. Appreciate your time, Senator Rennick. Thanks very much. Thanks very much, Steve. Senator Jared Rennick is an LNP Senator for Queensland, someone who's on that Senate inquiry into regional bank branch closures. Authorised G. Rennick, LNP Chermside.